Hi, my name is Ankur. I'm the founder and CEO at Market XLS. And uh, Market XLS is an Excel based platform for individuals and investment advisors to help make better informed investment decisions. Uh, we have created an options profit calculator for Market XLS users. This calculator, we believe, will help you with your options trading. So, what we are going to talk about is how do you access the calculator? How do you filter option chain by looking at the percentage above and below the last price? Filter the chain by expiration dates, strike range, moneyness. How do you do the option chain for indices? Uh, the Black Scholes value calculations. We'll talk about selecting the legs of your trade and then viewing the results, the payoff until the expiry adjusting the implied volatility and saving and accessing the scan and uh, continuing your analysis with the uh, excel with the uh, an easy way to export the options from the calculator so without further ado let me go to the website and show you how that works So first thing that you would need is you need to log into the website and to log into the website, click on the login button. And if you have an account already with Market XLS, then you should be able to simply use your email ID and password. If you don't have an account, you may need to create an account by putting in your information and your license key, which is part of your subscription. Once you have an account, all you do is simply log in. And once you log into the website, you should see a new menu that will show up on the left hand side. Click on options profit calculator and you get to the calculator. So here what you want to do is the first thing is you put in the symbol here. So let's say you put in Apple and instantly you would see the real time price of the stock of the underlying showing up here. And as soon as you put in the stock ticker, this table will show you the option chain right now this option chain and this table is filtered by these filters on the top so for example you could say i'm only looking at calls wherein the strike range is 20 percent below and 20 percent above the price of the underlying you could also specify the price in numeric terms here so you could say i'm looking at all the options which are from $120 to let's say $160 in this case here you could say I'm looking for options which are expiring after the 23rd of December and it goes to until 31st of December this field here is what we use in the calculations of theoretical value uh, using the Black Scholes model and you can of course change that so once you filter and select and input your scanning uh, filters, click on this refresh button to refresh the data here. Now you see the data that shows up in this table. This table can be saved as a CSV. So as soon as you click on this button to save, you should see an export CSV, uh, exported CSV like this which you can use for further analysis with market xls and once you have uh, the table here you could filter this table by clicking on these three lines above any of the column name and clicking on let's say you're looking for everything which is which is trading volume of greater than 20 contracts press enter and you should have the filtered contracts here you could also drag a column out of the view to take this column out of the view notice this column here which is the black Scholes value which is essentially the theoretical value of an individual option and uh, so this is 9.15 and this is 9.35 so this contracts last price currently is at 9.15 but the theoretical value is 9.35 so if you're buying this call option this is slightly 
undervalued and this figure is a ratio between the the theoretical value and the last price of the option so you can sort uh, this by the the metric and you can then start to select the legs of your trade so when you click on this you see four options so leg one leg two leg three leg four click on the first one and now this becomes your leg one let's say this becomes your leg two and the third option becomes your leg three and the fourth option becomes your leg four so once you have selected these contracts if you would scroll down you would see these four contracts are now in your table which is your uh, uh, your strategy table and in here you could add more rows if you are looking to add more uh, rows uh, to your strategy and you can simply input your ticker symbol here and the expiry date here for example you're looking at the expiry date of uh, let's say the 16th and the strike price 160 dollars you can select if it is a call or a put it will simply show you the payoff here now the good thing is this all this data is real time and uh, you can not only you don't have to select everything from the table above but you can simply update the row by clicking on these buttons here so simply selecting you know uh, these drop downs let's say you want to sell this put option and then you have these call options so you see your instantly your net cash flow result in case you're looking to uh, do a kind of a covered call or you just want to buy or sell the stock you can also simply uh, add a row and just put in the stock ticker here and then of course you don't need any expiration date or the strike price or the option type here because you're just buying a stock in this line and here you could uh, <coughs> uh, select the number of units so let's say you're buying 10 units uh, of this stock so now in you have like this is your net cash flow and you have uh, six legs of your strategy you can also click on this button to save as csv this view so you can always come back and check uh, the latest view of your strategy and see what's uh, what really happened but if you go down here you should see for each legs uh, your your profit and loss until uh, the day of the expiry assuming the price of the underlying moves from uh, 120 dollars to 160 dollars this is the uh, the range but you can of course change this range to say you know what what happens if the price moves from 140 dollars to 160 dollars and then you would see your payoff change right you can also export uh, your payoff by simply clicking on the save button as a snapshot so you can save uh, your payoff you can review each leg like this and see how your um, strategy is expected to behave given the price moves between this range you can uh, change the implied volatility of this leg this option to see the impact of the IV on the results the top line is the days to expiry and the column this column on the left is the price movement this is uh, you know the percentage of, assuming the price between uh, moves between $140 to $160 this profit boxes is all out of all the possibilities until each day of expiry how many boxes are like profitable and the maximum profit which is assuming the price moves between this range and this 140 dollars to 160 dollars within this range 
what could be your maximum profit and your maximum loss and then this is your payoff uh, at expiry chart so this is how you can review each and every leg and uh, and of course your uh, you know uh, payoff for all the legs combined since you're buying this stock uh, let's do this one so that we don't have the stock in here so you get a better view so in this case i'm going to say assuming that the price moves between 120 dollars to 160 dollars this is the net result of your uh, strategy with four uh, with five legs basically when you click on this save button you can actually see that you're saving all the results and the percentages so that uh, you can um, save this export and come back in time to see if your strategy behaved the way you expected it to behave so once you have this uh, strategy prepared and the scan prepared you can click on save scan and give your scan a name so you could say something like uh, my option strategy give it a description and then you can save this strategy and uh, you can save it in three different ways you could say something like i want to save this as a private strategy so only i can view this and no one else can see that and you could say that uh, i want to save this as a public so that anyone who is uh, part of this community of market xls can see uh, and review your strategy and then you have an option for your team if you're part of a group within market xls then you can save it as a team uh, strategy so your team members can see that in this case i'm going to save this as a private uh, screen so you can save this so this option strategy including your stock your uh, scanning filters and the, everything else your strategy your positions is all now saved so even if you clear this scan completely you can always uh, go back to your uh, your dashboard on the left hand side by clicking on this icon and click on options and here you should be able to see uh, this the same strategy so when you click on that it will load the calculator with your ticker and your pre-filtered options and your legs as well so you could see uh, what is going on with your strategy uh, now at a different point in time coming up in a second okay so this is the same view of your strategy but perhaps in real time so this way you can always come back and view your uh, the latest view of your uh, strategy so this is how you uh, use uh, the options profit calculator and the key idea is of course with market xls you save all this information uh, to not only see uh, and track your trades uh, in in this platform but also in your excel uh, with market xls and the idea is for you to be able to not only see a view right now for your strategy but also what really happened at different points in times with different snapshots okay so i hope you like the software if you want to play with it uh, go to marketxls.com and uh, uh, and subscribe to market xls you could also buy this uh, if you're just looking for the web-based platform you could also uh, just go to marketxls.com forward slash options profit calculator and you can click on get started here to subscribe at a very small price and get started with just the online calculator you would not need the uh, the full excel version but typically we recommend buying our full suit of uh, toolkit uh for your option trading which i believe will 
significantly help your options trading activities. So I hope you like the software. Thank you very much for listening and I really appreciate your time. Thank you.